Hi, this is the Crown Vertex here, Transplant Restoration Surgery. Um, this patient had a, well, a class 4 hair loss pattern. We did over a $3 graph and filling from the front to the back. Again, the hair restoration in the Crown Vertex is more difficult than the front. And because of the spheroid dome where the hair grows straight to your eye, um, you're going to need more than one surgery to have perfect de density or coverage. But considering with one surgery over 3,000 graft, filling from the front all the way toward the front, uh, from the back all the way toward the frontal area, uh, excellent coverage. The goal in the front hairline restoration versus the goal uh, in the uh, crown vertex are different. Number one, the goal in the crown vertex, uh, volume and density. The goal in the front is softness and naturalness. So then selection of hair graft is important. We use uh, root to grow single hair graft to try and plant in the front to make it soft and natural. But then in the crown vertex, we use larger root. Root to two hair, three hair, and four hair in the back for bulk and volume. We not only use larger root, but the angle of the hair in the front and the back are different. The front start on 35, 45 in the front, increases when you go backward, gets steeper when you go toward the crown vertex, and flare down uh, when you go toward, uh, further back. The third important factor is the uh, reinforcement. We're not only feeling the ball spot, but we're going to peripheral area and transplant hair around those areas to anticipate the future hair loss. So that way, when you won't have an island of hair as you lose more hair around the peripheral area. For more information, you can go to my website at www.mhtaclinic.com or call 1-866-999-6482 again. This is only a uh, 3 dollar graph. So this patient has a class 4 hair loss pattern. Heading toward 5, he's going to need probably more, more than one surgery to have better density. Again, because of the nature of the spherical dorm and the difficulty of restoring the crown vertex, people more often than not need more than one surgery to have perfect coverage. Sometimes you can get away with one. Thank you.